Everything that we use has been designed. The bridges we drive by every day, the houses we live in, the applications we use, and even something as basic as our spoons, forks, and knives have been designed. Some of these have been designed really well, with a lot of intention, and some of these have been designed poorly, without thinking of the needs of people who use them. The intentional good designs are critical to creating effective learning experiences. Habib University is the first university in Pakistan to understand the need and address this challenge by creating a unique space that is one of a kind. At Habib University, we created an ecosystem. An ecosystem to break disciplinary boundaries. A space to unlearn and relearn. A space to enjoy creative freedom. A space to play. At the heart of the space lies human-centered design. A creative approach to problem solving. Welcome to the playground at Habib University. I can't overstate how critical the design of the space is in creating the behaviors that happen in a learning environment. Spaces that allow people to collaborate, spaces that allow people to shift around, spaces that can both host like small group conversations or large discussions. They really help you go through different modes. And that's part of what's happening naturally in your brain while you're learning. And it's just incredibly important that the space really facilitates that. Playground is a physical manifestation of understanding problems by completely ignoring any kind of boundaries that have been created between disciplines and ideas. It's in the name, Center for Transdisciplinarity, where disciplines do not act like traditional disciplines. They don't act like boundaries. We have students who come here who are from policy, from design, from engineering, um, from computer science. And when they sit together and they work on projects, we're all creating knowledge together. Our critical goal always was and will always remain to rethink pedagogy, to rethink how knowledge exchange happens. We thought that this is an extraordinary opportunity to take ownership of learning mechanisms and do them differently and not be bound by any legacy of how teaching is done. Playground is very much in line with Habib University's philosophy on education, that education should not only be siloed, a computer science student need not or should not only be able to contribute to computer science problems. It's a very complex world where the problems are not just computer science problems, they're not just engineering problems. Any problem requires a solution which requires people from different expertise to come together. I have myself taught two courses. One was called uh, Intro to Service Design, uh, where we were learning what service design is and how do we apply it to real life projects. Then there was another course called Designing Sustainable Artifacts in which we were designing sustainable chairs for a chosen audience. My favorite part about the playground was just hopping in here and using this space as an enabler and a facilitator to bring my ideas forward, um, to collaborate with other people and to make sure that we have something which adds value to the people around us and to the community around us. Playground is like a blank canvas in many ways. There's really no limitation in the kind of experiences we can create, the kind of offerings we can give our students and the community outside, uh, the tools we want to use, and uh, the kind of collaborators uh, we work with. As a student, I believe that Habib's University's playground ecosystem is a place where great minds gather, great ideas gather to create something truly remarkable. The playground represents a mindset and an approach through which we believe we can make a real difference in the world. 
To learn more about the playground, visit our website.